Tell of the tape, Araujo is uh, one year older. He is the shorter fighter, though. Stenson does have the height advantage and the reach advantage. How will that play out for a man who has 17 wins ties, uh, by way of knockout, as Stenson does? Let's go to Jazz now for the official intro. Once again, welcoming our viewers at WSOF.com. We round out our preliminary card with three rounds in the World Series of Fighting Welterweight Division. Introducing, fighting out of the blue corner, his record, 26 victories, nine defeats, 17 wins coming by way of knockout with six submissions. He stands six feet, three inches tall and weighed in at 170.4 pounds. Representing Winfield, Kansas, ladies and gentlemen, Introducing Tyler, the Evolution Stenson. And now his opponent across the cage, fighting out of the red corner. 14 wins, four defeats, six by knockout, five by submission. He stands five feet, 10 inches tall, weighing in at 170.8 pounds, fighting out of Miami, Florida, representing, ladies and gentlemen, Valjeer. Your referee in charge is Jorge Ortiz. You ready? Are you ready? Time! And here we go, round one. Scheduled for three between these welterweights. Stinson in softball position. Start with kicks. Outside low kick, inside low kick. And as you know, if you're throwing inside low, you're throwing it with your power leg, but so counts for the opponent when he does that. Araujo, I don't know if he was just going to get inside his head. <laughs> that was a very powerful kick there. Araujo's hot right now, 11 of his 14 wins, coming by way of stoppage, boss. He likes to put him away. Yep. And that's what people love to see. Of course, Stenson's done even better. 23 of 25 by putting guys away, either knockout, mostly by knockout. And you can tell he's reading his opponent, Stenson is. Got his eyes wide open. And just looking at his movement the whole time. What is he doing? How does he react to this? How does he react to that? Stenson celebrated his 28th birthday yesterday. Looking to ice the cake here tonight in the WSOF. When I started my MMA career at 28. Oh, hey. That worked out pretty well. It worked out, yeah. So it was a little smarter. You ever saved up all those belts? <laughs> Pancrase, UFC. Uh, hey, oh, yeah, I got them. See, I'm going to forget them all if I start trying to name up all the belts you want. That'll be something. Stenson's won two straight after losing two straight. You know, the two guys he lost to, Tarek Safadine and Jordan Meehan during that time. Uh, yeah, Jordan Meehan is uh, coming from the father who trains the Boston system as well. And those are two great strikers. So he's faced tough company. Obviously, Stenson has. Lots of respect for, uh, for each other here, which is very normal. Nice kick. Yeah, he's got powerful kicks. Araujo. Constantly throws it out. Now if Stinson does it with his left kick, with his power leg, that will be to deliver. And that will be to the spleen, and that one connected. Wow. You heard it. You heard the impact uh, here. Our Ojo, that one blocked. No, and nobody says that a spleen shell doesn't hurt. Trust me. Só <laughs> Só 
again a kick to the body Arujo. Yeah, it was blocked by Stenson, but it was blocked in such a way that it still might go through a little bit. And now he starts mixing it up with inside low kicks, which is a very smart thing to do. Get inside the head of Stinson. And another kick. He needs to see if he can press him up against the fence and then go for that takedown. Stenson keeps looking the southpaw stance that he has. He keeps looking for that moment, but he hasn't come close to uh, any kind of uh, combination or being very aggressive at all right now here in this first round. No, it's really like he's really reading his opponent. He's not doing a lot. He just tried to figure him out. He's been patient, and as we can see on the oh. left side, a lot of redness from absorbing those kicks from Araujo. Araujo just came at that left high kick. That would have been two inches lower. That would have been a problem. You gotta watch out with those kicks, I believe. And then Florida, straight kicks to the knees are illegal. Final seconds of this first round. Araujo dictating the pace, the man in the white trunks. You guys can put that, was right a, here. that was a real interesting round for Stenson as he was uh, Feeling out Araujo quite a bit, boss. You wonder now if he picks it up or if he can pick it up here in the second round. Well, he has to pick it up because if he doesn't pick it up, he lost his round. So he needs to pick it up. He needs to win the next two rounds. He needs to start throwing combinations. But now he, he probably felt the power from Araujo. You know, those body kicks, one landed, and that, that looked painful to me. Not Second fighting time. with a mouthpiece. Did you see that? Second time. <laughs> Don't tweet me. I know. It's a mouthpiece. <laughs> Ready? Ready? Done. And here they come out for round two. This one is scheduled for three. Our Ujo in the white in the black trunks is Stenson. Right. You better believe it that the corner from Stenson said you got to start doing something. Now, this is bad. If Araujo can take this to the ground, with his last name, he has to be the better guy on the ground. Uh, you would think so, <laughs> would you? Araujo, though, right back up is Stinson. This is a great take down defense. the Over the arm and under the armpit from the opponent. You gotta keep, keep feeling him upwards. It's very important that his opponent cannot lower himself. This can also happen. And there it does. Arujo gets the takedown. That's it. You lift the legs up and then you sweep him with, the, with one of yours and take him to the ground. Stinson knows he's going to be in trouble if he stays on the ground. I don't know which horses I want to say because he also has six submission victories, so he probably knows how to defend submissions and how to apply them. Well, he did a nice job getting us back to his feet. That's it. And relatively easily. Yeah. Araujo, relentless, still trying to trip him up along the fence. I'm not sure Stenson looks like he's probably... If I was Araujo, I would start raining down knees, right knees. To the hamstring. What? Oh, inside On target, he's right just as he heard you. Just start throwing them. You know, you're there anyway. <laughs> Might as well kill some time. <laughs> As Stenson, has he got that? He's got a nice hold, boss. He looks like he's fairly comfortable given the situation of the pressure against him. Yeah, this is a uh, bigger trouble. Now, the same thing can happen as with the first takedown. Stenson, though, now starts falling out, spreading out his legs still. 
You see, he can sweep that. Araujo can now, no, now. But like he just had, in the scratch, lift him up. And he only needs to lift him up an inch. That's enough to sweep the legs. A taller opponent, needless to say, is harder to lift because he's with, with one of those scratch lifts. And Stenson just pushes him away. Gets back out to the middle of the ring. This is very smart on Stenson's part. And he needs to start working now, which he does. He's throwing his jab out more. He needs to start firing strikes. He's got to watch out for that kick, you see? Arujo is complaining Arujo to the referee. It's over, and yeah, then the referee, I don't know if the referee actually said something to Stenson or not. I think he did. Gotta watch out, because you do the third time. It's bye bye round. That's two rounds. So, you better not do that anymore. Oh, oh I think that's right kick. Another good kick by Arujo. You can counter those with the left kick of yourself. You block and right away you fire back. If you block the correct way by moving a little bit to the left, then you're loading up your left for the counter. So the block is simultaneously the load up for your counter kick. Works really well. And especially if you kick to the body or the inside low kick even, because if you do it fast, your opponent didn't put his foot back on the ground yet, so you kick one leg. And that, of course, uh, is never good for the person who receives it. So you wonder now about Stenson, who, while he was able to escape over here, and looked good doing so. Still suffered the takedown before, right? Yeah, he, yeah, and there's there's no offense coming at all. He's had no offense here in the middle of this cage. No, he's... Um, well, oh, that was a big left hand he threw now. Just as I said. And that was the counter. That's the counter for it. a single kick. And you that know, was you, his best punch. He block and punch. But you're absolutely right. You know what the problem is? Is that Araujo is really good on the ground as well. And he knows that. He doesn't want to go to the ground with a guy like that. So you start finding a little bit more cautious. Because everything you throw can be used maybe as a takedown for his opponent, for your opponent. Well, a good round again for Araujo, who had, I believe, was it two takedowns in that round? Yet, uh, no, one. One, one takedown. Uh, yeah, one he took him down, and the other one almost. Um, so this round probably goes to him as well. Here, lifts him up, watch, and he's gonna sweep with the other leg in a bit. Lift and sweep. Oh, he used, just used his hips to do it. Very nice. Valjir Araujo fighting now out of the Miami area. Yeah, he just needs to keep doing what he's doing. He's doing a good job. You know, closing the distance, uh, clinching, that is all him. Because in the clinch, he's throwing. His opponent is not because he's afraid to be taken down otherwise. So he shuts him down there. Second time. He constantly connects with uh, the right kicks. Stinson should really start using that counter more, that left spray. Well, look at the back of Stinson. If you look from the back, you can see it's purple from the right kick. Ready? To ready? the body, his toes flipped around that kidney area. Here we go, third and final round. Stinson in the black trunks, Arujo in the white. Stinson's going to need a knockout. Yeah, it would appear that's all that he, that's all he can hope for right now. Yep. And you see, as Boss mentioned, that uh, canvas that Orojo has painted on him with his feet. Yeah, you, know, you can, can see it all over the back. It is purple and red. And he's going to be feeling that for a while. Oh, yeah, he will. There's that kick again. Orojo, good low kick. This is so smart, you know. Because he makes him think it's another kick to the body. So all the focus goes there, forgets about his leg, and that's why it had so much effect like that it had just a second ago. Usually no, yeah, that was a nice one. That was one of his better ones. Yeah, and it was and a good, he that. but it was a good counter. <laughs> Counter's been his best punch. Yeah, but for also from Araujo, that kick 
The good kick that Stinson gave Araujo kind of counted as well. Oh, nice. Nice oh. punch by Stinson. Stinson, perhaps his strongest punch so far. Stinson. Araujo wants to get this to the ground right now, but Stinson won't have any of it. This is what Stinson needs to do. Move away now. And he's got to keep unloading. Oh, oh, body shot. Good body shot. Oh. And now a knee. And our Ujo. He perhaps needs... shake it. He wants to go to the ground. And he gets it there. Should never do this. Stinson should get back up. It is a risk that you're taking right now. Or you need a really clean shot. On the ground, if they bear hug you, all your striking is gone. This is good. This is good. And he gets back to his feet. This is very smart. He's got three minutes. Time enough. Plenty of time for Stetson, who has won 17 of 25 He's by way of knockout. He says, you got to stand up. The ref agrees. Yeah, otherwise he'll stop it. And this fight is changing in momentum. Simple front kick. Oh. A simple front kick can do it already because you hurt him to the body as well. A left front kick. They were never expected. Our Ujo is not able to oh. stop it. He's not down. He's down. He's out. The ref it's over. It. Wow! He needed a knockout, and Stenson gets it here in the third final round. Very impressive. Like you said, he knew he had to do it, otherwise he was going to lose the fight. And I bet you his corner said the same thing to him. And look at his back. <laughs> yeah. It is purple and red and orange. It looks like the guys that stay out in the sun too long. And here he comes in this third final round. Boss needing a knockout, and he does it. Boom. Yeah, that was on the money. You know, he was, Araujo was still fighting, he was just fighting on instinct. You know, he was, he was really, he was badly hurt already before, but he was just pure on instinct, you know? That, that tells you what a great fighter he is. So, uh, nothing but respect for the guy. Look at that left straight yeah. in on the chin. And Stenson, you know, that lanky frame, I think he's, uh, might be a little deceptive just how strong he is and how tough he is. Yeah, well, if you haven't seen him fight. 17 wins by knockout. That, the stats say it all. You know by the stats he can fight. This is his 26th win, 18 of those now by way of KO. Wow. So, but I like these fights. You know, you're behind, you really have to work. And then everything is put on the line in that final round. And if you do not do it, you're going to lose the fight. That's kind of cool in that winning. And you wondered about that strategy. We talked about that there in the second round. You know, he got the fight back up from the ground, but he really wasn't being aggressive. Maybe he was playing possum. It certainly worked. Oh, yeah. A lot of fighters do that nowadays also. Here it is. That's your boom. Araujo controlling this fight most of the way. Yeah. That was the right kick to the body. Here's going for a takedown swing. We got him on the ground. Couldn't really do a lot with him, but we knew from a fight before that takedowns count. That was the beautiful counter to the right kick. Yeah, and this was uh, after he days then. Beautiful right straight. Very nice and straight. And again, I know people say, oh, yeah, this is a straight punch, boss. Yeah. 90% though, throws him in an angle. He threw it straight. Tyler Stenson, his 26th win, 18 by way of knockout. He's celebrating now. His 28th birthday was yesterday. The, the You know that celebration is going to last a long time <laughs> down here yeah. in South Florida before he heads home to Winfield, Kansas. Yeah, yesterday he couldn't drink. And tonight is another day. Or maybe he doesn't drink. Let's go to Jazz and get the official time of that third round KO. Ladies and gentlemen, this fight ends at 2 minutes 23 seconds of the third round. Your winner by knockout, Tyler the Evolution Stinson. That is. Yeah. Ready. What you wanna do? If you don't strike first, that's when they gon' come at you. Yeah. And you know it's true. Don't let your life get worse. Being timid, that ain't cool. Nah. No.